Hi there. Now for part B of this question, we're asked to find an equation of the tangent then to the curve C at the point 3 minus 2, giving our answer in this form where A, B and C are integers. Now we worked out previously in part A dy by dx. So all we've got to do then is essentially substitute 3 and minus 2 when x is 3, y is minus 2 into here to get the gradient of our tangent. And then I can use y minus y1 equals m bracket x minus x1 with this point for x1, y1 respectively to get the equation of the tangent. So that's where we're going with this. So first of all then all I need to say is when x equals 3 we know that y equals minus 2 and we can substitute that in for dy by dx. And if you substitute these values into here, what you get is 22 over 6, which reduces down to 11 over 3 if we divide top and bottom by 2. So that's our gradient, and so therefore we're in a position to give the equation of the tangent. So just write in a quick subtitle here, equation of tangent, and we'll say the tangent at 3 minus 2. And what is it going to be? Well, it's going to be basically y minus y1, so y minus minus 2, equals m, the gradient, which is 11 thirds, times x minus x1, x1 being the 3. Multiply throughout by 3 here, just to get rid of this fraction, so you, therefore we're going to get 3y, and this is plus 2 times the 3 is plus 6. And then you're left with 11 times the bracket. So it's 11x minus 33. And to get it into this form, starting with a as being a positive value, which would be best, means I'm going to subtract 3y and subtract 6 from both sides. So we end up with 11x and then minus 3y. And then we've got minus 33 minus another 6, which is minus 39, and that equals 0, and it's now in that format. Okay?